Mark, 30 seconds to go before the start of the race. The lanes will be as we previously announced. Steve David will have the Oberto in the inside. The U2 Graham Trucking will be in the middle with the J. Michael Kelly. And on the outside will be Jean Theoret in the Lumar window film. Now they're coming to speed in the top of the second turn. Around the corner they go, less than 10 seconds to the start. They're lined up very nicely. Everybody's going pretty quick. Less than five seconds to go. Here comes the start. Mark, take it. The Alberto first across the line. Jake Michael Kelly in the Graham Trucking and Jean Theoret in the Lumar side by side as they cross the line after the Oboy Alberto down into corner number one. It's the Alberto on the inside and Steve David has got a lead of about half a rooster tail over the other two boats as they come through the turn. We'll see who sorts it out. It's dead even for the two second place boats and it's a good start. So nobody's jumped the gun and everybody's racing for first place. John Theoret is in second place and J. Michael Kelly in the Graham trucking third. They follow Steve David into turn number one. This is the first of three times around. Steve David at the apex of turn number two. He's got about a full rooster tail lead and years of experience. The wily Steve David takes him way outside. Now J. Michael Kelly has moved to the inside across the wake of the Alberto. He's in third place. End of lap two, it's the Alberto. Here comes Alberto around for the second lap. It was pointed out to us earlier today that Steve David is the only driver here this weekend that has won a race in the past. Most recently, he won the Madison Regatta a couple of years ago. He's about a full rooster tail ahead of the uh, Lumar with Theoret in the back, just starting into the back stretch, and Jay Michael with the U7 pulling up in third. A full rooster tail lead now for Steve David as he heads into the second turn of lap number two of this three-lap preliminary heat. This is the last of the preliminaries. The next time you see these boats on the water, it will be for the Thunder on the Ohio final. Steve David now comes past the exit pin of turn number two, points his nose downstream. Theoret is coming up a little bit on him, but he still has a substantial lead. One more lap to go for Steve David. Alberto first to cross the line, end of lap two, and John Theoret in the Lumar. Steve David took him way, way wide on that turn, and we'll see if he does it again. The Graham Trucking crosses at the end of lap two in third place, and he's moved to the inside, but he's getting a bouncy ride in the wake of the Oberto and the Lumar. Less than a rooster tail length lead for Steve David on the third of three times around. Jean Theoret trying to reel him in a little bit and flying the boat just a little bit as they head up the backstretch on the Kentucky side. Halfway through lap number three, Steve David and the Oboy Oberto. And in second place on the outside is Jean Theoret in the Lumar window film. Final time through turn number two. Looking for the checkered flag will be Steve David, and he's going to take John all the way out to about lane number six. And that's the way a veteran driver drives. Make him go the long way. Checkered flag for Steve David, the O'Boy Alberto. Second place to the Lumar window film and John Theoret. And third place will go to J. Michael Kelly as he flies the boat just a little bit off the turn and the Graham trucking. Well, I'd like to take this moment to say since the...